Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Anime and I would love if you stuck around by subscribing to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about, I think there's eight people or nine people that you should be following and this is specifically on Instagram. This is the second edition of this video that I've done. If you haven't seen my first one, I will have it linked in the cards. I think it's over here. I need to verify that. But um, it will definitely be linked in the cards and linked down below as well. So. These are just accounts that I think are amazing. They are typically more in like the preppy style, very girly style kind of things. I have the list here in my trusty planner and I will just get started. Again, if you haven't seen my first video, I would definitely check that out as well because all of those things still completely apply. Also, I want to preface this by saying, because I just had such a huge list, I have already started the list for people you should be following number three, because I basically capped it at the last person that I put down on the list and then thought of like three more people. So all of these accounts will also be linked down below. And yeah, let's just get started. So again, you're like, stop with the prefacing. I just want to say first, I'm really sorry if I pronounce people's names wrong because it's all like photos and stuff. I don't know how to say your name necessarily. Um, I will do my best. Sometimes they're usernames and I don't really get the pun. That happens sometimes too. So yeah, anything will be, I'll try and write it down here. Sometimes the person's actual name is attached to the account, sometimes it's not, but I will have them all down the bottom so you'll be able to see. And the anyways, they're all linked down below. So sorry if I pronounce it wrong. Continuing on. So I was going to screenshot people's like accounts, but I feel like kind of a creeper doing that. So I'm not gonna do that. So just look them up yourself on Instagram. As I said, I'll have the tag below. So the first account I'm gonna talk about is Hannah Statsny, I think is how you say her last name. Um, She has a blog that I believe is Pursue Righteous Living is what it's called. It's linked on her page. And yeah, it's overall just a super great account. You should definitely check out, follow her, everything like that. Um, Just photography, on point, everything, double thumbs up from me. Definitely give her a follow. So the second person is XOXO Hunter, and that is all one word. Um, her name is Hunter, um, or you know, some people don't like put their last name publicly, I don't. Um, but she, again, is a blogger. I think her blog is Hunter Elise or something, like first name, middle name. Um, and yeah, again, great account, just super good photos. I think I found her strangely enough through actually another person, um, like someone had liked a photo or something like that. Um, someone else who I'm gonna be mentioning in this video, but she's also involved in Irish dancing and she was going to Worlds in Ireland, which I thought was cool because I'm Irish. I know a lot of people who do Irish dancing. So I followed her then and yeah, she goes to, she's in college. She goes to Biola, I think is how people say it. I think it's the Bible Institute of Los Angeles. Um, so yeah, she also mentioned some like Christian things occasionally and yeah, definitely give her a follow. Really cute account, check it out. Number three on this list is someone called Sarah and I'm not actually going to try and pronounce her last name. I, I honestly, I think that is her last name. I have no idea how to pronounce it like whatsoever, um, even though it is quite short, but I'll have everything here. Um, what her username is, it's it is S-L-V-E-N-C-K, so, but her name is Sarah, and basically, if you need some girl boss inspiration, she's she's the person to go to. She's not a blogger, but her Instagram is, is basically like a blog. Um, she studies chemical engineering in Purdue University, and she has had some banging internships, and it's just really interesting. So, yeah, you know, if you need some, like, you know, need to work hard at college, uh, inspiration, then definitely follow her. I also believe she's Colombian, so she has been to Colombia a couple times and her travel photos are amazing. So, you know, travel inspiration, working hard inspiration, just overall girl boss. So number four is Devon Foster, her both her username and her actual name, um, also known as Girl in Gingham, that is her blog. And she is like a preppy style account, so like classy, amazing. Um, again, just you know, what else can I say? Follow her, so, so good. Um, I think she has graduated college. 
I'm pretty sure. And she also has such lovely like coastal photos and sometimes she's in cities but she's always dressed so classy and yeah. So definitely follow her. She also has amazing hair. 10 out of 10 for Devon Foster. Follow her. You won't regret it. Number five on the list is Hayley Shobar, um, otherwise known as Young Cosmopolite. I think that's how you'd say it. So she is a blogger as well as has a poppin' Instagram that you should definitely follow. Um, she is a student in UC Berkeley, I believe. So um, it's always nice to see college gals doing their thing. Um, I'm a final year in college, I didn't say that before. But um, yes, overall, I don't really know what to say when I'm saying. I'm just saying like, these are great. You should follow them just because I say so. <laughs> so again, she's another one of those. Check out her Instagram, give it a follow if you aren't already following her, um, cause it's amazing. So number six, if you love Disney, this is the one for you. Eve Taylor, um, which is her name here on YouTube, on Instagram, and is her actual name. I think it's like her first and middle name. And yeah, if you love Disney, you will love this. Or if you love like retro things or people doing Dapper Day, stuff like that, you will love her account. So um, Eve, seems to be another student of Biola in Los Angeles. And it was through, I think something that she liked, maybe, I'm pretty sure that's how I found it. Um, I found the account of XOXO Hunter. And even though I don't, don't know if they like know each other, but Eve Taylor makes videos here on YouTube too, um, which I'm a big fan of. And her Instagram with her and her boyfriend or friends go to Disney, she goes to Disney like all the time, well gel because obviously I live somewhere there is not Disney. Um, it's just so cute and so many cute, like real retro looking photos. Just def like, you will just look up her account and you'll see it and you'll go, oh yeah, follow that. Um, really, really cute. And she and her boyfriend are really cute together. And, and again, similar to um, Hunter, XOXO Hunter, uh, she does mention some religious things sometimes, some Christian things. So either if that is your style or not your style, just letting you know that as well. I'm just mentioning that because I too am a Christian. Um, I'm not so strong in some of my views on certain things um, because I'm very uh, liberal leaning. So leaning, like fully standing there, not leaning. Um, but yeah, so just putting it out there if that is or is not your style. It's something that I kind of like to see. So um, yeah, I thought I'd just mention that. Another name I'm going to struggle to pronounce is number seven, Courtney Massenden. It's her name, it's her Instagram handle, and you may know her from back in the good old days. She's still on Tumblr, but I'm not really on Tumblr anymore, um, as Too Preppy to Function. And she started making YouTube videos for a while. She was on YouTube for quite a while. She doesn't make that many YouTube videos anymore, but is still very active on Instagram and Instagram stories, so I would definitely suggest following her there. She does not have the same very like classic preppy style that she used to, but her style is still amazing and I'm not someone who's like dead set in one way so I like to see other people's styles and really you know even if it's not something I'd necessarily wear I like seeing someone else style something really well and be like you go so definitely follow her she also does a lot of things on skincare which I'm interested in because if you are new to my channel you wouldn't know I have very very bad skin I have had since I was about 14 I've been dealing with cystic acne since I was that age so I am um, I'm always up for looking at some new skincare things and masks and she tends to do a lot of like natural products and stuff. So yeah, she has just started at a new college this year, which is kind of fun and interesting. So yeah, I've been following her for quite a while. So I would definitely suggest following her. And if you're like, oh, bummer, I talked to her one time. Maybe, I'm, why am I in this? You're probably gonna be in the next one if I'm being totally honest, because this is actually a list from like last time, Blondie Esquire, I think is how you'd say her username. And I think it is the name of, it is, I know it is, the name of her blog also. Her first name is Jen. And if you are interested in politics, she is definitely someone I suggest you follow. First of all, she is very, again, preppy, classy style, love it. But she's also um, very vocal in her political views and she is definitely a supporter of the Democratic Party. She would be more liberal. And she also thinks that Hillary Clinton is bae, much like myself. So um, every time she posts something political, I'm always like, yeah. So if you are maybe that way inclined too, I would definitely suggest following her. She is another girl boss of this list. And um, yeah, it's just really nice to see someone being vocal in that way. If I, I don't think I mentioned the reason it's Esquire is that she is an attorney, uh, which 
means her like double girl boss so that's why I think there's a lot more weight to what she says sometimes and um, she posts if she's um, contacting people in politics and stuff like that you know to push certain movements forward and yeah I would definitely suggest following her again as another girl boss encouraging you to do and live your best life and <laughs> so yeah definitely follow Blondie Esquire again link down below I'll have it all here and whatnot but yeah just another great account to follow Hopefully I've been able to cut this video down a little bit. I just spoke nonsense for so long because I didn't know what to say about each individual account other than I think they're really cool. Um, so basically that is my list of people, number two, of people you should be following because I think they're really cool. That is what this should be called. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. If you think there's another account, maybe I would enjoy, maybe it's yours comment down below and um, I'd love to see it and if you haven't already followed me on Instagram it's at anime.yt and it is also linked down below so that is it for this video subscribe to my channel to see more from me and I will see you in my next video